Hello and welcome to Mr. Walton's physics lessons. In today's lesson we'll be looking at weight, mass and gravity from the forces topic of GCSE combined science and GCSE physics. By the end of the lesson you should be able to describe the difference between mass and weight, and calculate weight using the formula, weight equals mass times gravitational field strength. Gravitational force is the force of attraction between masses. The gravitational force from a planet makes objects fall to the ground, gives everything its weight, and keeps satellites in orbit. In everyday life we use the words mass and weight to mean the same thing. However, in physics, there's an important difference between them. Mass is the amount of matter in an object, measured in kilograms. Weight is the force acting on an object due to gravity, measured in newtons. Mass doesn't depend on gravity, so Bradley's mass stays the same, anywhere in the universe. Weight depends on the strength of the gravitational field, so his weight would change if he traveled to a different planet. The gravitational field strength of Jupiter is larger than that of Earth, so Bradley would have a larger weight on Jupiter, but his mass would stay the same. Weight is calculated using the formula, weight equals mass times gravitational field strength, or, W equals m times g. The unit of weight is the newton. The unit of mass is the kilogram. And the unit of gravitational field strength is newtons per kilogram. Try this example question. Calculate the weight of a 40 kilogram person, part A, on Earth, and part B, on the Moon. Gravitational field strength on Earth is 9.8 newtons per kilogram, and on the Moon, it is 1.6 newtons per kilogram. Pause the video and restart it when you're ready. Firstly, write the formula, weight equals mass times gravitational field strength, then, substitute in the appropriate numbers from the questions, so, weight equals 40 kilograms times 9.8 newtons per kilogram. The person's weight on Earth would be 392 newtons. For part B, go through the same process but this time, gravitational field strength is 1.6 newtons per kilogram. This gives the person's weight on the moon as 64 newtons. So to summarize, mass is the amount of matter in an object, measured in kilograms, and it is the same everywhere in the universe. Weight is the force acting on an object due to gravity, measured in newtons, and your weight is different on each planet. Finally, to calculate the weight of an object, you use the formula, weight equals mass times gravitational field strength, or W equals m times g. If you've found this useful please give it a like and consider subscribing to see future lessons. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.